she out. What the fuck going on, bro? Mm, 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 mm. Yo, salute, 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 salute. I'm trying to figure out what's going on right now. I'm trying to figure out what's going on right now. We got D.I. the Haiti Bear to borrow. I'm at my cousin crib in Connecticut right now. You know what I'm saying? Yo, we got QP coming on. I just jumped online. And, yo, QP name really be everywhere. Like, what the fuck? Like, this is crazy, say. Yo, Rain Fire Moon, what up? This is... Brody, do you review EPs? Oh Lord, you want me to hear a whole album? Yo, okay. yo, what's, yo, Snake Eyes, what's up? Yo, you see, I thought to hit you up first. Hold up, Snake Eyes, stay around, son. Stay around, son. Like, yo. Oh man, I love this shit. This shit be crazy right here. Shout out to the whole Connecticut. Yo, Snake Eyes, you. Damn, I just asked this nigga to cue the car to come on though. I really want to hear what Snake Eyes got to say right now. You know what I'm saying? Had a battle. I feel like he beat D.I. Yo, Tiger. What up, Tiger? Word. Like, yo, what up, Ja? This shit crazy. This shit. And is, is niggas giving Snake Eyes his props right now? Yo, OTFMZ. What's good? Y'all probably the only, y'all the only niggas I got where every notification goes off. That shit is crazy. You seen Gwitty versus Zay? I had Gwitty beating Zay, but Gwitty just lost the aura. I was talking to Gwitty yesterday. You know what I'm saying? I was, yo, Swagger Reacts, what up? I was talking to Gwitty yesterday. He actually admitted losing the aura from Dot Mob. So, nah, it's not about them arguing about who won. You know what I'm saying? I just want to know, like, so now what? That's the question. The question is now what? And then I want to holler at, at Snake Eye. I want to know who the fuck he got next. You know what I'm saying? Like, Snake Ben deserved his props. That's a fact. You see QP and J400. This is what I'm saying, son. This is what I'm saying. Yo, QP name be everywhere. That shit be everywhere, yo. Word. That shit be everywhere. I ain't even gonna hold you. That him and J400 shit is just like, all right. All right. This is crazy. Henny, a blogger. We don't care. That's why I'm bringing Henny Man on tomorrow. To ask what, like... How does he consider himself at this point? You know what I'm saying? Like, word. Like, like what we doing with that? But at the end of the day, we can't just bypass this Snake Eyes and Henny Man back. Like, fuck that shit, B. We're not just going to bypass that shit. You know what I'm saying? Henny Man did what he did. Henny Man did what he did. I don't think it was a 30, though. I thought it was 2-1 myself. I'll probably watch it again. You know what I'm saying? I thought it was a 2-1 myself, but Snake Eyes definitely won, in my opinion. So it's just like, now what? This shit is crazy, man. When niggas don't be on URL, it be like a whole different journey, I feel like, versus being on URL. You know what I'm saying? Like, I feel like at this point, Snake Eyes promote crazy. He needs some of the top battles. And it's just, you got to unfollow who? You got to unfollow who, Rainfire Moon? And he averages hell, stop it. And all the other bloggers said 30p. I'm not worried about the other bloggers. I, I worry about myself. I don't care about what other bloggers say. You know what I'm saying? All the other bloggers did not say 3-0 anyway. I just watched Chris blog earlier. He didn't say 3-0. He said 2-1. Yo, clean. What up? Yo, what's up, nigga? I'm trying to get it back. What's up? Where you niggas at, man? Come on, man. Let's talk our shit. Pull up, clean. I can't wait till I get home tomorrow so I can really get crazy and shit. Word. Yo, QP, what up, QP? What's the word? Chillin', man. Chillin', 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 chillin'. What's good with you, bro? Shit, I was on the phone with QP, man. Hey! Yo, oh, Clean, shit. what up, Clean? Hey! How you do that? How the fuck you do that? Do what? How'd you do that, bro? I was just FaceTiming this nigga. Hey, man, we got, we, got, we got our magic working over here. Yo, what up, Clean? Hey. What up? Y'all niggas want to know a secret. <laughs> What's up? Before we get the show started, that nigga hit man holla up, bum ass nigga, dog. <laughs> Why you say that? Oh, my Lord, Instagram. I didn't forgot what Instagram was even like. Why you say that? Hey, Q. Hey, Q. Hey, what they say on the wood, Q? Man, you got a Lisa number? Man, you won, nigga. That shit worked. Ten of them skeezers in there, nigga. 
Hey, wait. Man, this Why nigga stole the six hold, 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 hold on. Wait, no, let me finish. No. Wait. This nigga stole a six figure deposit? Man, that nigga won, bro. That shit worth way more Yo, than what we did. You took. talking about the AR? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, you talking about the ARP tweet I just seen? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Nah, but hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Hitman said this has been good, so he's gonna uh touch down and hit up AR. Damn, QP. Damn, QP. He said he was going to call ARP like see where he's going to battle. Like I said, man, listen. Like I said on the last live, my nigga. Even if you hit that nigga up and say, hey, bro, we going to hash this out. You still stole the deposit, bro. The fact I don't that think ARP, that stole the deposit, bro. Okay so, you, okay, so let's analyze this shit, right? Why would ARP go on Twitter and say, hey, man. I see you in Mexico skipping around with our $60,000 deposit. Call the office upon return. This means that I called your phone a hundred fucking times and you wasn't answering the phone. And okay, my next step is I'm taking it to Twitter. You don't answer that. My next step is I'm going to that little room that I go do my fucking blogs in and I'm putting you on the fucking flow. That's the next step. All right, hold on. I, I totally disagree with you, Glenn. Okay. I think it was a joke or anything. I don't think Hitman stole his deposit, bro. Wow. Y'all think he... Y'all really think that? Man, run that cheese, man. You okay, wait a minute, a wait a minute. Wait. Hold, like up, hold clean, up, hold up, hold up. Y'all think, think ARP... Number one, he says six figures. He ain't say 60K. He says six figures. That's what I That's said, six figures. Y'all really think Hitman stole Y'all think Hitman stole it? I don't know, bro. They maybe they was joking. Maybe they wasn't, bro. But if it listen, if he took that, man, he got a leash number, nigga. They said, "What am I on about J four hundred block? Who is J four hundred block?" <laughs> they said who? <laughs> they said who? J four hundred spear with that round ass head. Go ahead, though. J400 block, a 3D square. This nigga is... Hey, yo, can I ask a question, QP? Like, yo, why are you even beefing with J400 block? Like, what happened? What started all of this? Oh, you oh, you say, why am I beefing with J400? I'm not beefing like, with bro, like, what? Like, I seen the little bit of the back and forth. What's going on, bro? I'm not beefing with J400 block. I was we beefing with... not beefing. Ain't nobody I was beefing, beefing with Bonnie. Me and Bonnie, Bonnie. Having a, me and Bonnie was having a brother and sister quarrel, right? And then I'm looking right. in the comments... And I see J400 Oval in the bottom, like, nigga, this is between me and my bitch, one. Like, you feel me? Like, 13, 12 years of history. I don't need no nigga in the comments rooting on for Bonnie. Bonnie got enough goddamn fans. Nigga, root for me, nigga. Oh, and since you you, you don't want to root for me, Jay, right? Let's just, let's just relax before I drop a bombshell on the whole fucking community. How about that? Like, just don't mention my name. The nigga in the comments still mentioning me. I'm already beefing with gay niggas, bitches. I'm trying to beef with the realest nigga possible. So I was like, oh, J J400 Spear. I'm on this nigga head. He said something else. And I got to the to the effects of, I say, nigga, don't you mess with Jada Ray? Right? Shit that nobody knows but me. And I was just like, don't you put hands on her? Well, put hands on me when you see me, nigga. What's up? Then the nigga what? came up on the show, right? Oh, got up shit. on the show. I say, hey, put that on your mama, nigga. That you never touch the bitch. He hopped off the live before he could answer on your. You could lie and put it on your mama. He couldn't even lie and put it on his mom. I don't got a cap with you, nigga. What I got a cap with you for? And if you want to see me and do something to me because I called you out on it, then see me and do. And then don't associate my man right here either. Like that's my brother, and he always step up in the gap. Oh yeah, shit, nigga. hit him. I'm lost. I didn't yeah, see it all. Bro, I don't know what's going. On. I spent like two minutes of it. Cause bro, I hate. Let me and let me say this, bro. I hate right. when this nigga get into it with somebody, bro. And then motherfuckers always be like, "Oh, uh, here come clean, bro. Uh, clean got uh, clean gonna come and say, clean about to come and say some. Uh, clean about to come, nigga. Listen, y'all motherfucking right. Clean about to come and say something, nigga. Fuck is you talking about? Oh, yeah, hey cap, hey cap. I slap all my hosts. Ask them bitches on Instagram, do I put my hands on them? You know what answer you gonna get? He ain't never touched me. Who the hell? It could be a video online with me slapping all my bitches like, Brrr. 
and ask them online what they gonna say. I got my beat up hoes trained too. Shut up, Jay. Oh, she said that it never happened. But did the world know that Jada Ray and motherfucking Hey, hey hold Jay on, hold on. What's this nigga name? Hey, Coke Boy, hey, Coke Boy Vine. Hey, don't make me start beefing with Jay, bro. On some real shit, bro. Cause it ain't no ain't none of these bitch niggas. Hey, ain't none of, hey, hold on, cat. Ain't none of these bitch niggas in battle rap ever made me cop no motherfucking plea, nigga. I jumped on the live and told Jay that he wasn't touching my mans while I'm right there, nigga. He got to be fucking stupid if he think that's going to happen and I'm not going to do shit, nigga. So how the fuck was I copping the plea, nigga? Quit dick eating on here, nigga. Fuck out of here somewhere, nigga. Now pull Jay up here. Because oh, hey. niggas know what clean body like. So stop listen. fucking playing with me, nigga. Hey, listen, listen, listen. If you, if you use a scandal and say, fuck oh, QP. you talking about, nigga? I never Man. told that nigga it was up, nigga. Fuck you mean, nigga. They seen the live, clean. They seen the live. You had Bonnie and Jay calm. Like, they was upset with me, but they was calm when you got on there. That's a fact. We don't have to do that. We don't even got to yell. I'm just telling him. You know, I don't, have, I don't just say shit for fun. So it's like, yeah, I'm beefing with Jay 400 Black. Let's see if something happens to me. Or let's just see if bitches just keep getting beat up because he ain't going to touch me. Like, and I'm never in New York with clean. You feel me? Oh, I went to New York with clean one time out of 20. Okay, that's cool. Philadelphia. What? Hey, hold on, hold on, hold on. No, this bro, this sounds crazy. They don't want to hug their kids and shit, bro. Or go home and beat their bitch up. They don't want to go to jail. They don't want to go to They don't want to go to heaven. You ain't never heard clean cop no plea to none of these bitch niggas in battle rap, nigga. Ever, nigga. Let me put my fucking face on this bitch so niggas know what, what it is, nigga. Never, nigga. To no nigga, nigga. No nigga, nigga. Not J, not A, not B, not Z, not 500, not 600, not 800, 700. Nobody, nigga. Now run and tell that, you pussy ass niggas. I don't I don't want to wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. All this fuck is a nigga talking about nigga. Don't turn me up on this live nigga. Hey, don't turn up. Why are you turning up for J400 block? That shit crazy. Listen, man. Just the nigga was trolling me in my comments, right? He was trolling me in my comments. Me and Bonnie arguing about my chocolate thunder ad from seven years ago. We arguing about that. This nigga in the comments talking about what's up, chocolate thunder. I said, is that J400 block in my comments? I ain't never even heard from this nigga since my 18-year-old bitch got pregnant. So this is the second time that I seen this nigga saying something about me. And I'm like, just not a nigga to mention. You mention me, I'm going to be like, hey, what was you saying about whatever you said? When I see you, that's me. Like, so I was like, say it again. I'm going to drop the bomb. Niggas don't even know that J400 fuck with Jada Ray. So already, right? Because his first thing should have been, I don't even fuck with the bitch. That ain't my bitch. He got on there and just said, I didn't beat her. Nigga, how the fuck do I know way on the other side of the coast that you put hands on this fucking bitch? Nigga, because one, me and QP, there's half and half of the bitches. There's the half that really fuck with him, and then there's the other half that fuck with me. Like, there's not no female battle rap bitch that don't have a comment about the QPs. So, like, Jada Ray, I was in her inbox for seven years, right? Cordial, back and forth, I'm, I'm building. I get to clean, clean already, then been through it. I'm like, damn, Q, every time it comes to a bitch, this nigga clean is either further than I am or a step behind me. But it's always a story. So when we get your bitch, nigga, we just be chilling. So if a battle rap nigga say some shit like, oh, Q, you a male escort. No, nigga, I'm definitely not a male escort. I'm a pimp. But you know what you is? You's a wife beater. What's up, nigga? And then you get on there and don't say, oh, no, nigga, that's cool. <laughs> you don't deny nothing. Stop playing with me, dude. All right, look, check it out. This is not even why I even got you up here. You know what I'm saying? To be honest with you, I seen that. I, I actually seen something about Bonnie saying you had a ghostwriter or some shit like that. Yeah, I said, man, I've been telling. That's not even why I even. People if you want to be real, I really got you like, niggas up whole, here. Honestly, listen, I did this for the bitches because it's it's important what? that the bitches be able to breathe when they vote trying together like all men battle rappers do. Like, there's a couple niggas that write by themselves in a corner, right? Murder Mook. You know, people who don't take nothing, you know, they don't take anything. They just rap how they feel. And then they go up there and get booed off the fucking stage or they have a good battle here and there. But in between, they getting booed. The key to battle rap is on the level that we are, $113 million contracts, six-figure deposits and all this shit. You can't come half-ass. You got to come with the best material. So this shit is more like you got premier stand-up comedians that went from Laugh Factory to the stadium at Madison Square. You're not going up there with material that's just your own. You're going up there with material that's pre-medic that's premeditated to fit the masses of the world. So I told Bonnie when we were arguing that Clean helps me write, Bill Collector helped me write, Bangs helped me write, all the greatest niggas in the world. And I'm not saying I help my niggas. Yeah, all R three. 
So with that being said, relax on Vine and chill on all the bitches that, that you feel me? Because with men, we can do whatever we want to do. And nobody complains. Nobody complains. I can go out there, clean and tell me a line right here. And then I go my next battle rapid. They're going to go crazy. And there's no questions asked. But I'm saying for the girls, it needs to be equality because they have just as great as pins as we do. It's just everybody is Voltron. It is $40,000 bags, $50,000 bags, $100,000 bag. Why the fuck would you just go right spiritually? That's fucking crazy. Like Sue Surf, Why is that crazy? the greatest writers in the world are writing with people. EFB, gun titles, it's the terrible. brotherhood, like you name it, that's what it is. So I threw myself under, not none of my niggas, me. Everybody keep talking about, oh, cute, cute, hell effect. He always want to throw niggas. No, throw myself under the bus. It's me. The nigga that write is the nigga that take, the nigga that give. I'm all of those things, bro. This is battle rap. And when people get up there and rap like Holmesy the God do, that's because Holmesy the God still raps by itself. You feel me? When people get up there and rap like, like gyms do, that's because gyms writes by itself. Like, just look at the people that's forgettable. They write by themselves. The people that's forgettable. not, they're, they're there. Surf, Geechee, Rum, niggas don't write by themselves. They write their own material. But when it comes to, hey, yo, man, you about to battle, you should say scream and die like Whitney Houston. He's going to say it. He's not going to not say it. Niggas in the comments sound, y'all like sound Whitney dumb Houston. as hell. Talking That's about EFB and them ain't writing together, bro. Y'all stupid as fuck if y'all think Calico just battle surf, bro. Y'all dumb as fuck for thinking that, bro. If y'all think gun titles, EFB, and all these other niggas ain't helping each other and writing together. Y'all sucking dick on my kids mm -hmm. and all these. I'm not, so everybody's bro. helping everybody right now. They don't have to get it, bro. Clean. They don't have to get it, nigga. Like, you ever got a $5,000 deposit off a $50,000 deposit? That's what we battle for. You think niggas is just going to step out the house and go battle every time to see that type of money? Hell no. My cash app jumping and my PayPal jumping all year without me ever seeing a major stage because there's more money in that than all these little leagues put together. Niggas is retarded. You've got to know that this is the writer's time. The fuck? Let me ask you a question. Let me ask you a question. Are y'all still going to battle? This is the main reason why I even called y'all up. Are y'all still going to battle <laughs> Geese and, um, and Rum Nitty? Battle. I would. I mean, we would. I thought y'all were going battle. I thought it was locked in already. You feel me? We, I mean, them the two top niggas that you feel, at least if we went against Geechee and Rum, then I feel secure with knowing that only Geechee and Rum writing that shit. You feel me? Because them is the niggas that niggas run to. So y'all so still want to battle them? Yeah, we still do that shit. So is it going down or not? I thought I could have sworn y'all said it was definitely locked in. It's still you, so locked in. Clean or just cute? Either no, one of y'all. No, it's it's still just, locked in. It just ain't no telling like when them niggas want that shit to go down. The niggas who paid for it, like when they want it to go down. That's I, all. We was set, we, remember oh, we was set. DC had took that battle on URL the same day that our shit was set for. So that's why the shit got postponed. And in, in the meantime, like we don't even caps. We don't even give a fuck about battling no fucking Geechee and Rum, dog. I ain't gonna sit here and hold you, bro. You don't? Like, nah, hell no, not even a little bit. Me and Q. Why not? Nigga, not even a little bit. You feel me? What? Because we're not pressing issues to make uh, battles that ain't real happen. Like, we want battles to happen that really got a storyline, that really means something that, that is aligned. I hate a battle that's just thrown together. Like, you know, I like that Rum Nitty used that Scream and Die with the Houston bar, because that was an S one S bar. So, yeah, when we battle, I'm going to be like, nigga, that's crazy that you don't want to join Suns, but you want to use Suns bars. Like, that's kind of wild, my nigga. That's kind of wild, Rummy. Yo, this nigga QP <laughs> Bro, I don't understand why niggas get so mad. Like, y'all niggas be wanting to know, all y'all dick eaters in the comments, y'all be wanting to know so much what's going on, right? And then as soon as we expose the shit what's going on, y'all get mad about the shit and want to dick eat. Y'all some dick I mean, ass niggas. Hey, do you want me to get my other phone and pull out the Snapchat with one of the writers? He's a writer. He don't, he don't battle. He just write bars. And I got the Snapchats for like five, six, seven years. He send me the bars to tell me shit's fire. He'll be like, I'm like Hector from Friday. You don't want no smoke with me. Yeah, they said they didn't like that. That was corny. I got, you can scream and die like Whitney Houston. You can scream and die like Whitney Houston. That's crazy. They didn't like that either. I got nothing but bars like this from just a million people. And then these bars that people send me, they're in my circle. So they hit the stage. And when niggas rap them, and you don't at least hit the nigga up and be like, yo, man, I appreciate that haymaker. You know, scream and die, stretch and die like Whitney Houston's on every fucking poster. That's all. That's all niggas wanted. I, I want money. 
but the fans and shit. Just show appreciation. Do you know how many fans then gave their favorite battle rapper the haymaker of their battle? And they just do it out of the goodness of their heart. No, this is just regular message. If you message, oh, you battling Mook this weekend. Well, you know, Mook mean gay, right? So you got to gaze into Mook's eyes and put your pupil up. Oh, okay. And then Mook's kind of an intelligent hood rapper. He's going to be inclined to be, like, you know, like everything is a fucking bar. So I don't know, bro. It's hard to try to smooth that over, even when I throw myself under niggas like QP and Chatty Patty. And it's just like, y'all niggas just don't want to hear the truth. Like, all these niggas who are super hip-hop culture heads, they don't want to hear what battle rap is. When you write a movie script, is niggas so showing up with their own lives? So listen. Let me say this real quick, right? So y'all niggas, uh, y'all niggas to sit up and y'all to sit up and bypass the fact that that it came out that that Surf and Rum Nitty right w wrote they battle together and shit, right? But but y'all go. But what you mean? Oh, 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 what you mean it came out? Well, like, what you talking about? Oh, that oh that ain't come out. Oops, my bad. Yeah, but then y'all to sit up and, and what you bypass. talking about? Oh, nothing. We ain't talk about nothing. But yeah, then y'all to sit up and bypass the fact that niggas is helping each other. Y'all niggas is crazy, bro. You niggas. The whole thing crazy. at this point is kind of obvious that people are helping each other. Everybody wants yeah, to be. I would think at this point. Get mad because you bring it up. I'm, who cares, bro? I don't, I don't care if they get mad. Really, I don't. I just and then the fans that get mad are fans that wear caterpillar boots and lugs and shit. Like the niggas that wear Timberland double soles, they not out here complaining. Niggas that own houses and shit, they're not complaining. These is these niggas that live in the home that they grew up in. Like, these is them niggas in the comments, bro. I swear to God, because I, I do my research. I got nothing but time work from home. So I read the commentary, I pin them in my mind. Then I go look the niggas up. Niggas got three pictures on their Instagram profile, right? And waking up talking to me and clean who's online every day bringing you content. If you don't like nothing about me and QP, don't tune in to us even now. You see the QPs up here? Get the fuck off the lot. What the fuck are you doing here? Caps, did you did I wake up and call you this morning? Or did I get woke up from a call from you and jump on, right? So no, I met you this morning, it was good. You my nigga. I don't even call you to get on your show no more. If you don't call me, Cap, I don't even want to get on your show because I refuse to come up here and speak to these fucking sheep and they keep telling me, oh no, rum rum nitty's the greatest puncher ever, and that's it. No, you hope nigga. Rum nitty's the greatest puncher who fell under a formula plan that we had and still uses bars from our fucking ghosts. So, okay, I'm lost. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Let me ask you a question. Do y'all do this to get future battles, or y'all just doing this to do this? Nah, do I didn't even know you were going to ask about anything that you're asking about. I just woke up and, and was breathing. Yeah, inhale, that's what I was about exhale. to say. We ain't had no game plan on what we was doing when we came on here. Like, this ain't no game plan. To, like, I'm telling niggas, like, what I, this, I'm not saying that Rum and Surf wrote together because this is some shit that I think. This is some shit that was presented to me. This is some shit that niggas already know. Niggas gotta already know the shit if the shit was presented to me because I don't pay attention to this shit. I don't give a fuck. What? Come and just say that. Like, yeah, just, you feel me? And ain't nobody gonna do shit to me. Not surf, not rum nitty. So I don't give a fuck. Who gonna do something to clean? Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, so you got so you know for a fact that this is wild right here. Okay, I didn't expect all this shit this morning. Wow. All right. All right. Look. All right. So how do you squash some of these beefs you niggas got out here? I don't, I don't got no beef, beef with no fucking battle rap Q. niggas, bro. Q, do we have any beef? I don't got beef with nobody. I, me and Bonnie cleared everything up. Me and Bonnie are good. Bro. Clean and Bonnie. Because Jada, well, right, my thing, Jada Ray said you was lying. So my thing about it is, if y'all niggas is battling or trying to battle in New York and all this shit, then why in the fuck are y'all beefing with other battle rappers? That doesn't make any sense to me. Ooh, I'm not okay. beefing um, with hey, no fucking be, body, bro. My, my own I didn't watch the live. I didn't watch the live. I'm not even... I didn't watch the live. I seen, like, two minutes here, like, three minutes over there. So I don't know what the fuck the live was even about, honestly. But what I'm trying to say is, y'all niggas are all battle rappers trying to get money. I don't understand why y'all niggas is going so hard to get at each other and shit. It's kind of crazy to me. I, I don't like gay slander. If you come on my shit talking some gay shit, I'm going to immediately get straight to it with you. Now, you see what I did Oh, because there? you gay with the chocolate to thunder. To I'm not playing those type of games. J400 Block already brought up my young baby mama being pregnant once. So I just was chilling like, okay. That's just him speaking his mind. Then the nigga spoke up about the male escort shit for some years ago. And I'm like, nigga. I don't want to hear that shit. The bitches can say it. The gay niggas can say it. But if you a straight nigga and you bring that shit up, I'm coming straight to your city to find you and then be like, say that shit again. Because niggas is 
for real. Like, nigga, I said what I said. I'm not capping. Nigga, you a wife beater. If I beat up hoes, niggas respect me for beating up hoes? Fuck no, I'm a pimp. A pimp that beat up hoes get still respected. No, you a straight square nigga, right? And then it's just like- Okay, wait, 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 wait. Why does a pimp get, hold on, hold on. Jada Ray reside and where she sleep and where she posts and where she do them posts. Then how the fuck do I know that, dog? How do I fuck do I know Jay and Jay to fuck around? How? How nobody else know that? You know I know everything, dog. I got a cap. And then niggas want to go at me because I went at J400. Y'all should be happy that I'm a beating nigga up or shooting nigga up that's fucking beating up on bitches. Especially a fat, skinny bitch like Jada Ray. Jada Ray weight go up and down because she suffers from multi-personality and borderline personality disorder. How do I know this? How, do, how does Quantum know that? Oh, I know why I know that. Because I know fucking everything. How do I know what jazz pussy tastes like? How do I know any of this shit? How do I know what 40s neck smells like? I don't fucking know. Oh, I know how. Because I'm really him, Caps. And it's okay. You feel me? I'm just glad you called me because when your fans with no icon pictures and their avatar start telling me that, oh, I'm a chatty patty, I just be like, no, I'm just a nigga you tune into. Period. Like, you feel me? Forgive me. <laughs> not, I, I don't apologize to J400 Block. I apologize to Jada Ray because I should have been picked up on this shit some time ago and I should have been came and slapped J400 fucking bald head ass head when I said that shit. Uh... You feel me? Yo, this is probably why I even got you up here for all this extra shit you're doing. Because here's my thing about, like, like what do you... Uh, y'all niggas be having an issue for nothing if Jay, bro. If Jay, if Jay 400 called and apologized... Nah, y'all niggas be funny as hell. Like, I want to know who the fuck y'all battling next to shit. Bro, you know you born niggas on this bitch to turn this bitch up, man. Stop playing, bro. Bro, you understand? Let me tell you something, B. Turning up don't mean starting beef. That's, That's not, not turning up to me. How, how do I start beef? Bro? All I do is reply. If how am I beefing with somebody and I'm replying? I reply to what he said. I'm like, is that J400 in my comments? Talking about oh, male escort. Hold on, Q. Hold on, Q. Y'all got niggas all day long, bro, that jump on lives and interviews and shit, and they just be like, oh, yeah, clean, clean and QP, they this, they crackheads, they this, they that, and y'all just laugh at the shit. It ain't starting no beef, but then as soon as we talk our shit about niggas, oh, we starting shit. Niggas is crazy than a bitch, man, and y'all acting all these bitch-ass niggas, man, y'all gotta be stupid as a bitch if y'all think a nigga gonna come on this bitch and turn me down, nigga. I don't give a fuck who y'all at, nigga. At anybody who you want to, nigga. I don't give a fuck. All right. Anybody who right. want to, nigga, because I'm, I'm no, nigga, no, this the type of shit that be starting this shit, bro. Like, I'm sick of this shit, bro. Like, y'all niggas have to know, bro. It, it done been so many niggas that threatened me and said what they was gonna do and do this and this and that, dog. Then be at the next event that I'm at, smoking with the nigga who's smoking with me. So stop fucking playing with me, bro. Okay. Y'all niggas, I, bro, clowns yeah, for I, real, I didn't want to talk, talk about that because and then they're going to change. You feel me? Like, you feel me? People got to look at each step. If I tell you that Jada and J, J400 block is an item and you never knew that, then just assume since I knew that and you didn't know, that I know everything else that you don't know. That's it. So if you want to say I'm hating, I'm hating it. It's, uh, you know, I got neighborhood watch. This is the domestic violence watch. If I see a nigga that's tough, tough, I think Jay's tough. Like, tough enough to beat a bitch up, for sure. Tough enough to put He's hands no on me. not no bitch. No. I, listen, we not saying that, that Jay 400 is a bitch, bro. I you know say Jay. That. You feel me? I'm good with Jay, nigga. Like, I jumped on the live and told niggas that yesterday. Ain't nobody saying that that nigga's a bitch or, you know, he a hoe. Oh, nigga, he just be getting punked in. No, ain't nobody saying that shit, bro. No, nobody is saying that, my nigga. Nobody is saying that it be the niggas and y'all niggas that start. So when Jay was jumping on that bitch and was like, oh, yeah, QP, you this and you that, and Chocolate Thunder wait, and all wait, that, wait, that ain't starting shit, these huh? niggas ain't Whoa, what was Jay saying? He even punched on no damn body. Who, where, who battle fans are these? Like, they don't know who, what QP's, what we then did and what we do in the streets. Is niggas retarded. Can we start pinning some of the mean shit that people uh -huh. are saying so that I can start finding some of these folks? This shit is funny to me, bro. Like... Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Jay Fox said daylight used to write with me. Yo, Fox, what you talking about? Daylight used to write with you. What are you talking about? This is crazy, bro. Bro, y'all niggas really think that I, man, listen, bro. I don't give a y'all talking to me about a nigga who I thug with, bro, who done did shit for me and who I done did shit for versus some battle rap niggas who ain't never did shit for me a day in their motherfucking life, bro. I don't give a fuck about them niggas, bro. This nigga on here on this live with me is a nigga who I give a fuck about, bro. 
go there for and with my nigga y'all talking to me about some niggas who i don't give a fuck about bro i don't care about no battle rap relationship bro a battle rap relationship ain't never did shit for me in life bro ever bro all right. friend, bro. None of these niggas, bro. So stop saying, oh, y'all beefing with such and such and such. And it, it can get like that because none of these niggas is my friend, bro. Just because I say what up and hey, and we kicking and laugh like that don't mean that we fucking friends, bro. I don't talk to these niggas on the regular. Fuck is niggas talking about, bro? Okay. Okay. About a battle wow. rap relationship, nigga? You think I give a fuck about being friends with some niggas uh, across the fucking world, bro? No, I don't give a fuck about that, bro. Why the I fuck is CC show in the that. comments on this backup page? This shit crazy. CC show DNA two. This shit crazy. We beat the fuck out of CC show when we see him. Huh? DNA two for CC show. We tracked his IP addresses to the same IP address. He didn't. He didn't block his IP address for the last six months. And then the same IP address from two years ago when he had the CC show. It matches the DNA two exclusives IP address. It's the same in one. Um, I divulged this information, but maybe only ten or fifteen thousand people heard it. So I mean, I'm glad that he came here so I can say it on your network, which has way more followers. CC Show is DNA too, and you know he he started to come outside, but you probably won't see him outside anymore now that I've divulged this information. He probably don't know what divulge means. It means unveiled. I I, I released new information that was unbeknowing to the people. You feel me? So shout out CC Show, the nigga that used to be like he panned again. He did the beef. He fell off because niggas was pressing him in real life, right? So he started DNA what too. The fuck? I don't got no reason to cap, bro. Feel me? And this is the funny part. When when Jay, because what I did with Jada, like she for sure gonna get her ass beat. So when he go for domestic this year in 2022, I don't want to hear none of y'all. I'm gonna tell all y'all, fuck y'all. Soon as he get locked up for domestic, or matter of fact, I'm gonna get his real name and search it so I can pull up his domestic history, right? And when I put it up, I don't want to hear that, bro. I beat bitches up, bro, and I stand behind everything that I do. Like, he don't stand behind nothing. You beat bitches up, and you don't All stand right, hold on. Number one, all right, hold on, hold on. QB, you kind of actually kill me right now. Now, at one point, number one, I think him females is corny. That's just me. So, at one point, you're coming at, well, that, fuck, that's just me. That's corny, in my opinion. You come that J400, you're, you're saying he puts his hands on females, but then I've you're taking him, pride like, at the fact that you're doing the same thing. I'm lost years. there. I had no problem with the nigga. I've known that for two years. Just like the jazz rapper, I knew that for five years. I was just waiting. Don't play me. Don't You see how these people in the comments be like, oh, Q always, he ain't crazy, never bro, done. Bro, I just bro. shot whole niggas. And they talking about Q ain't never stepped on the fly. Shut up. I want to hear that. I continually prove myself every year, so I'm not really concerned about what the fans say. I'm just more like, make sure you see me, you take pictures with me and the other QP like they always do, and just make sure somebody put blood in our mouths this year because we ain't bled yet. Like, when QP didn't bled? When QP didn't bled? QP didn't put blood in people's mouths, put people in the hospital, but when have, when have I bled? When have I got press? When have I got, oh, Sway pushed me across stage eight years ago? Okay, that toughened me up. So who pushed me across stage since then? That toughened you up? Yeah, because people kept saying Sway pushed you, and I'm like, it was battle rap. It was a battle rap push. So I rapped past the push. Niggas was crying right. out. And I'm like, oh, okay, cool. That's fine. I'm not tripping, bro. It's just interesting. All right, all right, all right. All right, this is real uncomfortable to my head and female. I don't know how the fuck we even I got guess, hey, guys, right, right, Who y'all got you. next? Fuck no, all that. Who y'all no, got next? No, it's uncomfortable talking about hitting, hitting females and all that. So let's get back to hitting niggas. You feel me? Let's get back to punching on niggas and shit. All right, bet. Cool. All right, so... So y'all talking about all this shit what niggas did to my mans 10 years ago, right? And niggas had all opportunity to do the same thing where y'all see that nigga with clean, bro. Why niggas don't do that shit? Why do y'all want him to do? Like, why do y'all want people because to do I, that? Be, because I, it be these bi I, I really be wanting to show these bitch-ass fanboy niggas out here. Like, I really be waiting on a nigga to, 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 to really, like, to, to really do something, bro. Like, man, like, nigga, push the hard line, bro. Beating his ass. Push the hard line, bro. Like, for real. Bro, bro. Like, what the fuck happened to battle rap? Do y'all care about battling anymore? Yeah, we can do that. Or we can get, we can get into that other shit, too. Yeah. Yeah, that's all I'm saying. Like, battle with. ill will. Of course he's still battling. Just battle all ill of will. That. Does that not count? A nigga can't relax that, for four months after battling ill will? He can't chill? This there be too much there be too much bullshit in battle rap, bro. This shit, uh, shit getting ass. I ain't gonna hold you. 
Talk y'all shit, but God damn, bro. It's like we don't even talk about battle rap no more. It's always some extra shit. Like now. I said, no. like I said, bro. Just like look in the pistol bro. and shoot the next nigga because you got to shoot three niggas. What? Credit for it, be a shooter. Okay, wait, bro, wait. Bro, what did you? No, 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 no. What you just say, QP? Which one? What you? You? What you just said? In battle rap, you have to do something three times to be respected for. So I shot a nigga once. I'm already oh listening. Lord. I'm not tripping, bro. Why is battle rap got to be so fucking WWF, bro? I got to say all fake shit. I got to say all shit that, oh, man, bro. You know what? J-400 is not a wife beater. He don't know Jada F and Ray, right? She, he didn't Jada F Ray up. You feel me? Uh, who else? Let me see. Uh, 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 I don't know, man. Whatever y'all want to hear. Whatever the fake publicist answer is, that's what my answer is. I'm not telling y'all no real shit. I'm tired of this shit, bro. Like, that's crazy. I showed niggas that they're, everybody got a ghost. Nobody want to hear you. Well, you just sat here and said you waiting to, to, to pistol whip the next. I don't know what's going on. You know how so I would. Stop I them one time. Like, what the fuck I got to do with battle? So what, though? I'm not what you mean? What you, with, on, with dude, what you mean? What that got to do with battle rap? Everybody gangsters, right? Everybody what happens to niggas who want to get their money and no, out of battle no, rap no, and move no, forward? Fuck all, no, fuck all that. Everybody gangsters, right? So why don't you just get to a boxing look, ring if that's the case? If y'all that adamant, why don't y'all just say fuck battle rap? Let's all become battle rap boxers and handle it like that. Why don't y'all just do it like that? Drugs turn down the fight with me. Yeah, there's a battle rap boxing league. Shit. I forgot about that shit. You know I'm outside, bro. I'm with all that shit. I actually work out every day. Niggas out there eating ice cream sandwiches and push-up pops and shit, talking about what they gonna do when they see me. No, nigga, you don't even touch the gym. Shut up. Nigga don't, even hit, nigga don't even hit the shooting range. Right. You don't do nothing that... Man, I do all that shit every day, bro. Carry my baby mamas on my back. You feel me? Like, the fuck is they talking about? Okay, okay. Ugh. All right. I mean, I hate you, B. I hate you, B. Yo, all right. I mean, so what y'all want to talk about now, B? Because I really want to talk about battle rap and shit, but I don't really feel like y'all give a fuck about battle rap at this point. Real shit in, in, in the... Outside of battle rap, like the rap is cool, but now battle rap is about the, the, the climax outside of battle rap. So if the face off, if the storyline ain't what it is, I don't want to see that battle. If me and Clean battle any of these niggas, be beefing with it'll be a great battle. Be some shit people want to see other than just QP versus and QP versus. Like, no, let's put some real battles out that people want to see with grudge. Okay, matches. but let's not go too far to sell the actual battle that it actually starts problems. That's the reason why I stopped fucking with the live because I'll be seeing too much bullshit going on that. I don't want on my live. Fuck all that. Everybody else can have that shit. I don't want that shit on my live. Okay, well, this is my battle rap. What I can do is just not upload it. But I mean, I'm sure you know with my shit, if you got to put those little key points in there because it's gonna do numbers on, on the little on the YouTube. So I'm not worried about my. So you all right? Right. So wait, now we getting somewhere. So you're actually purposefully doing this because you was the same person who was coming at me saying, "Yo, back in the day, used to be about controversy. Now I see your brand is about battle rap." Da da da. So which one is it that you actually want? Um, when I come on your show, I notice I just go off the comments. Because when you call me, I really don't know what to be for. Like, when you hit me up today, I'm assuming because somebody had my name in rotation and you hit me like, Let's Nah, that's not why I hit you up, bro. It's because I didn't go live in Mad Long. Oh, you know what I'm God. saying? I wanted to see okay. what... I hit you up. This, listen, I hit you up to actually see after this Geechee, body, Geechee got in the award battle, was y'all still going to battle? Then I seen a two-minute clip over here, you going back and forth with Bonnie saying you had a ghostwriter. I done interviewed you a million times over this ghostwriting shit. That's not why I called you. I'm never going to call you because of some wild controversy. It's not that serious. Okay. Yeah, I'd rather, I'd rather yeah, see yeah, dope I battles, have, and that's just what it is. All this extra know. shit, I'm not really cool with that shit. Yeah. Because you got to think about it. It doesn't benefit you. J400 may see you and punch you in your fucking face out of all this, or vice versa. You see what I'm saying? All I, over I a fucking wanted, IG I live. Punched in my face. I want a man to punch me in my face. Man, okay, straight. you're not you're not hearing what I'm saying here. You still talking shit. What I'm trying to say is it can go either way. You may see Jay and punch him in the face. Who the fuck knows? Why would somebody I would, I would, want I that? I wouldn't beef with Jay over battle rap. He mad at me. He says some shit. Bro, to playing, you know, Q, bro you just said he's beating on Jay the Ray. That's not battle wife. rap. Look, look, look. He said, "Q, you a male escort." I say, "Nigga, you a wife beater." Then you want to fight me. What is the difference between calling? Oh, see, I didn't see the live. I didn't see the live. I keep telling you, I didn't see the live. Okay, but I'm saying in a, in a world, in a man to man world, you, I say some shit to you, Caps. Cap that hat too fucking loose, nigga. That hat look like a fucking. You can either choose violence, or you could choose this to be neutral, or you could choose to respond. I choose violence every time. Don't mention me. I'm 36, Jay. Don't mention me, especially on no male escort shit, because then I'm a really. 
put some real information out there that's that's factual. Bonnie will get on you and tell you that the male escort shit was capped. All my hoes will tell you it was capped. Daisy, the one that posted it, tell you it was capped. But then J400 telling me it's real. No, Jay, do something to me when you see me, bro. And I don't mean that to incite violence. I mean that to be like, you tough. They say that I beef with weenies. They say J400 kind of tough. Well, let's see who's the toughest then. That shit is simple. This is battle rap. Who want to just see? Well, a question. What, what kind of money do you get out of that? What kind of? No, I get respect, bro. Like, people would be like, damn, man, you, you don't back down to anybody. And I'd be like, no, I don't, bro. Like, I wake up every day. I'm raising five kids. I got a sixth one on the way. I don't want no pussies in my family. I don't want no softies in my family. I mean, I, even I, if, one, I, of my, even if one of my kids turn out to be gay, he going to be Omar from the wire gay. No pussies over here. They could be whatever they want to be. My daughters, my sons. But scared is not one of the things that they will be. I, I live and die by that shit, though. Caps for real. If you look at me and my whole, like, everything I've been through, is is battle rap and your real life, they kind of intertwine. And You know what? I think I know what's going on right now with you, bro. Do you feel like because you was getting clowned before early in your career, the, the sway several, I remember before there was some old tall T, that do you feel like you have to make up for the past? Yeah, I've been on the I've been bro, I've been the last three years, like You've been on some shit the last three years, on some renegade wild and shit. Do you yeah. feel like you're making up for the past when niggas was like pushing you around and trying to chump you and shit like that? Do you feel like that's what this is going on with yeah, you? It, bro, it's all over yeah, bro. You was never like this. Never like this. Happen, a lot of people want to approach me. I, I, you know, I went to New York maybe three, week, three weeks ago. Like, I got a Come lot that of Debo people. on live like that and... Mm -hmm. Got an apology from Debo. Got an apology from Jims. Got an apology from Chris Unbiased. Mm -hmm. I'm getting behind the scenes. I'm moving away. Like, when I get on here and move, it's kind of not respected because gangsters move in silence and shit. Like, if you're really moving like that, so I do both. I be online talking shit and I be behind the scenes moving the same way. So it's like I'm very adamant about things and a lot of people, when they fly around places, they're just flying to the place by themselves. I'm driving two, three cars deep everywhere I go so I can press this hard line. What, what is like, all man, you was talking about? Yeah, let me pull up about? here and come smoke with you, nigga. Why, man? What you say, Clint? Y'all niggas is crazy, bro. And this is what I be saying about these niggas like uh, Hitman and, uh, and, 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 and niggas like... Uh, all these Jersey niggas and nigga, I done lived to where y'all was at before. You feel me? So I don't give a fuck about no fucking battle rap relationship, nigga. When it comes to me and my fucking brother, bro, a nigga who I done been through the mud with, a nigga who I done did shit for and done did shit for me. Y'all think I give a fuck about some rap niggas when it comes to that? Nigga, no. No, no, all right. Now, Clean, I can see you. I definitely see why you hold QP down. I'm not, I'm not, I mean, like, like y'all brothers, I get that part. That part I get. I'm not, no, I'm not knocking you for that, but okay, I'm I'm trying so to figure out how are you niggas getting money if y'all niggas just be beat like I don't know, bro. I don't know. Anyway, off that. Yo, clean the corny corner. Talk to me. What's going on, bro? Yeah, we got a couple of niggas to put up in that bitch today, bro. And that's what's that's what's going. I'm going back. I'm I'm going back to uh, my apartment today, and I'm about to do my show. You feel me? Oh, so wait a minute. Oh, Lord, have mercy. What has he started here? So the corny corner is going to be about people that you that you going back and forth with? No, it's just going to be about people who doing corny shit, period, bro. You feel me? So you just, you just on some air niggas out type shit? Yes. Oh, yes. shit. I'm on some it needs to be talked about type shit. I'm on some air niggas out type shit. I'm on some I don't give a fuck who got a problem with what the fuck I'm saying type shit. And niggas should respect this shit because y'all got a nigga like two who throw rocks and hide. I'm not hiding my face. Niggas know who this is saying all of this shit. You feel me? So y'all they saying add two. What two that? I don't even see two. So y'all got free will. Like when I be in y'all city. You feel me for five, six hours at a time. You feel me, or that or, nigga CC or, or show not coming up here, bro. You feel me? Y'all got CC like show not tooth, coming up here. It's like like Tooth was talking about. Oh yeah, uh, you you in North Clean? Where you at? Uh, yeah, woo woo woo. But then I I I, I in, I'm in North the whole motherfucking time, doing my motherfucking thing, dropping locations in Jersey for you to pull up here and pull up there, and you not gonna pull up. You feel me? And all these niggas be wanting to be gangster for a crowd, you feel me? So my whole thing be, when niggas say, oh, clean, um, 
Yeah, you a crackhead. All clean. Kid, all clean. Uh, you do this.